Namaste Galactic family. Welcome back to my channel Indigo Angel. Come on into this dimension guys. Be sure to subscribe, hit that notifications bell, comment and share and come on into this little mini energy update that I wanted to put out tonight and talk about what's really going on right now for those that have taken the cure or have taken the Jim Jones Juice Elixir, Love Potion number nine, whatever you wanna call it. Um, essentially, there are things right now that have been happening and are continuing to happen um, as me and Dr. Rose discussed when I had Dr. Rose come on the channel the other day and she was talking about the symptoms that of all the people that were coming to her that had taken the cure. So I think we're going to start continuing to see a lot of things that are being justified as other things, justin, justinified. <laughs> so I know some of you guys have seen the the new news this was just put out the other day that justin bieber has revealed his partially paralyzed face and they're saying that this comes from that this comes from ramsey hunt syndrome and ramsey hunt syndrome comes from a virus that comes from the chicken pox okay so uh, if you haven't uh, heard about this, um, it's all over YouTube and the news and, and all over Google right now. But um, I'm just going to play a part of this video here uh, for you guys. So half of basically half of Justin Bieber's face right now is completely paralyzed. Watch this. Hey, everyone. Um, Justin here. Uh... I wanted to update you guys on what's been going on. Um, obviously, as you can probably see from my face, um, I have uh, this syndrome called uh, um, Ramsey Hunt syndrome. And it is from this virus that um okay guys so i am not going to play that entire clip because it is a couple minutes long but this is what i'm talking about when we're talking about symptoms coming up randomly and healthy in young people that are now starting to have these crazy illnesses present okay so it's not really really strange we know what this is from we know that this type of symptom and happening is coming from the jim jones juice elixir okay not only is justin bieber have half of his face paralyzed but Essentially, his wife just recently, one month ago, two months ago, has recently suffered a blood clot or had a mini stroke and had a blood clot travel from her heart to her brain and caused her to have a stroke. Also, another very young, healthy girl who's now having crazy symptoms, okay, and all the medical doctors are going to make excuses and say that it's not because of the JJ elixir. Okay, let's get real. We know what this stuff is from. Okay, it's from them poisoning. It's from the depopulations and the eugenics uh, agendas that are running. And... I think we're we're heading into a very unknown timeline. Um, you know, a lot of those lab rats that they initially were testing the cure on, 
um, never actually made it. They said that all of them actually were disposed of by at about the two year mark. Okay, so I'm not putting this video out to cause fear. I am just putting this video out to just say, pay attention to what's going on because these types of things could potentially start happening at a much faster rate. Um, they said that um, SADS, which is Sudden Adult Death Syndrome. So this Sudden Adult Death Syndrome has been basically hitting Twitter, hitting all social media. It's trending, essentially. The sudden adult death syndrome is trending. Why is this sudden adult death syndrome all of a sudden trending? Okay, um, it's basically where someone goes into cardiac arrest, um, someone who's, you know, under the age of 40. Um, it's an umbrella term used to describe unexpected deaths in young people. But why would we all of a sudden be having this increase in sudden adult deaths? And why would this sudden adult death syndrome be trending on social media as we speak? Okay, they're going to try to continue to sweep it up under the rug, justify it with other things, label it as other things. But guys, we can see through these illusions and these distortions and it's just really sad that people don't want to wake up to what basically Klaus Schwab and the head of the corporations of the uh, Jimmy, jo Jimmy Jones Juice Corporations, okay, the ones that are making the cure, the head councils of those that are making the cure. These are the guys that are pushing the depopulation agendas, okay, so... I just want you guys to know, I wasn't prepared to make this video tonight, but I just started piecing together these dots and I really just wanted to just share this with you. So kind of leading into the reducing of population, um, there was actually a video that went viral of the head of the uh, cure the guy at the head of the cure, the, the CEO, the top guy that participates with Klaus Schwab in the World Economic Forum, uh, there's actually a video that went viral, even though they're saying that the video had been altered. Okay, but we actually don't really have proof that the video was altered. But essentially, this is what he supposedly said in this altered version that did go viral all, ac all across the globe. 2023, we will reduce the number of people in the world by 50%. 2023, they will reduce the number of all of the people in the world by 50%. Now, they say that he later goes on to say this. Today, his dream is becoming. Was by 2023, we will reduce the number of people in the world that cannot afford our medicines by 50%. I think today his dream is becoming. I really don't know if I trust any of this, to be honest with you. Just because they went and did that doesn't mean that that really wasn't the agenda behind all of this, considering that he is completely in cahoots and he is the CEO of the people that are basically profiting off of this. Uh, cure the people that are profit pro profiting and are becoming billionaires and jillionaires um, off of this agenda that's been running. This is just a video here of the head of the cure uh, beneficiary, and it's what is wrong with his neck? They're saying like these are the elite Dracos. Okay, see what he's doing with his neck there, you guys. That is not normal. Okay, this is somebody in a body portraying to be something that he's not. I think that these guys are the their Draco informants or they're some medium level 
Draco, um, they're on a Draco campaign, right? They're, they're here petitioning and doing the dirty work for the hierarchical Draco royalty lineages, okay? The ones that are sitting behind the curtain. This guy is in with Klaus Schwab, Butt Schwab. This guy is in with Klaus Butt Schwab. And the reason why I'm making these connections is because Klaus Butschwab, father, was an intimate confidant of Hitler. These are all of the top elitists working and cutting deals at the World Economic Forum. Okay, these are the guys that are coming down the Rothschild lineage, coming down the Draco lineage, coming down the not see lineages okay and so this is this is the belly of the beast that we're dealing with here and i just wanted to kind of string along all of these connections so you can see where the money uh that is being profited from siphoning off of death culturalism which is a cultural that is indebted to death okay it comes down through these agendas. It comes down through these particular people, okay? And these are the ones that we need to be looking at when it comes to sudden adult, de sudden adult death syndrome and 25 and 28-year-old perfectly healthy, young, beautiful people getting brain clots, brain aneurysm, strokes, heart attacks, and Ramsey's syndrome, okay? This is not normal, you guys. These are not coincidences. And this is something we have to pay attention to. So I've quoted Mr. Butt Schwab before um, in other videos that I've done, but this is an excerpt from his book, The Great Reset. So at least 4 billion useless eaters shall be eliminated by the year 2050 by means of limited wars, organized epidemics of fatal, rigid, rapid acting, acting diseases and starvation. Energy, food, and water shall be kept at subsidence levels for the non-elite, starting with the white populations of Western Europe and North America and then spreading to other races. The depopulation of Canada, Western Europe, and the United States will be decimated more rapidly than on other continents, okay, which is what we're seeing right now, okay? If all of these people who took this cure start to present with uh, Bob, uh, Ramsey syndrome, strokes, blood clots, sudden adult death syndrome, okay, they're going to normalize this sudden adult death syndrome, you guys. That's what they're going to do. Um, until the world's population reaches a manageable level of 1 billion, of which, which 500 million will consist of Chinese and Japanese races selected because they are people who have been regimented for centuries and who are accustomed to obeying authority without question. From the time there shall be artificially contrived food and water shortages, which is what we're experiencing right now, artificially contrived food and water shortages. Um, and medical care to remind the masses that their very existence depends on the goodwill of the Committee of 300, which are all of these Draco people that implement the agendas. So it's just really super crazy. And I felt like I needed to um, just bring some awareness to this again and again and again, just bring more awareness back to what they're really trying to do here, what this whole damn thing has been about. Hold your compassion, hold your integrity, hold your morals, okay? Don't be afraid to ground yourself in these things and live and fight for these things, okay? Um, they want to create fear clouds, especially with this artificial food and water shortages that they're pumping through the mass media right now, right? Making everybody think we're out of food, making 
us believe that we're out of a, a baby formula, okay, which they are out of baby formula. But I mean, that's all goes back to symbolically goes back to the attacks on the mother arcs. I talked about the attacks on the mother arcs. Um, it comes from that. It comes from our lack and separation um, to our mother. And also, um, it, it goes back to the, the breast and symbolically what the breasts represent and mean in terms of nurturing humanity. They want to take that away as well. And they want to create something called fear clouds because if they can create fear clouds, okay, especially with these artificial shit storms of not having food, um, they can distort your discernment. And that's really what they're attacking. They're trying to confuse you out of fear in your body, in your brain, um, and send all of this fear neurological messaging because they know it will scramble your compass. And your compass has to be strong to make discernful decisions. And we all have this like inner discernful compass that is our spiritual guidance system. So we cannot allow these fear clouds to come in and disrupt our discernment. Um, we have to remove the fear and we have to remove lack of trust in our relationships with our higher self, okay, and with the universe and with faith and with God, okay, and at the same time, we have to make the effort to not become stuck in unrealistic, delusional type things because it's a time where we have to really stay grounded in what is real and what's not, okay? Um, we have to stay grounded in helping people learn from these lessons that are being presented here, okay? Helping people and supporting them through the ascension process. A lot of these people who are going to be dealing with these syndromes, these pox, these strokes, these blood clots, okay? These are people that are going to be waking up, because their body is at risk and that's what happens when the body becomes at risk okay their soul finally wakes up okay so they're going to be bringing a lot of new waves into the ascension but we have to overcome these fears because they're all generated intentionally like i said to block our discernment and um what these people are doing the world economic forum klaus butt schwab the head of the uh, Cure Corporation, okay? Um, these are the internal dark dwellings of humanity. That's what they hold within their fields. Um, and so we have to fill these spaces with light, okay? We have to no more have automatic impulses that internalize the frequency of fear or darkness okay and that's what these people are all about so anyways guys i'm i'm rambling right now but i just wanted to send everybody lots of love and just don't be fooled by what's going on like they're gonna try to normalize all of these things and act like oh it's because of this or because it's that or he had it because of this or she had that because of that. And it's like, no, they don't want to look at the root cause of these things. And so that's why we have to share this information with each other just to keep us all aware. Okay, so I love you all. Have a beautiful night and take care.